Field for tonight, 10th and final race on the track, and pretty to the post, Superfect the wager, and exact the wager, and a field of 10. No changes in the nightcap one, Simcoe Zimage, owned by Max Mauser, Darren Mauser drives. Two is the Derculator, owned and driven by Charlie Conrad. Three is Grand Sid, leased by Steve Morningstar. The arrangement is Elliot Deaton. Four, C.J. Baker, owned by Shirley Robinson. Dave Hawk will be aboard. Five is No Stone Unturned, owned and driven by Charles Smith. Six is Benevolent Viking, owned by Mark Clark and the bike bike Wilder. Here's the seven, Branson, owned and driven by Kane Kaufman. Eight, High Albus, owned by Larry Fullen with Brad Hanners. Nine, Wholesale Merchant, owned by Gary Davis with Bob Harper. Number 10, Banker's Note, owned by Bill Carruthers. David Miller will be in the sulky. Pacers and drivers for the 10th and final Super Effect, the feature is also exact a wagering. Six minutes till post time. Gate is moving. All lined up. They're on their way on the far outside. Branson takes the lead. Here comes Simcoe Zimajet from out of the second tier. Banker's note is away nicely to third. They're down the backstretch. Derculator is fourth. Between horses, Grand Sid fifth. They're moving midway on the turn. Driving up on the far outside, Wholesale Merchant. After that comes C.J. Baker. No stone unturned. Benevolent Viking and High Elvis as they move by the opening quarter mile pole in 29 and 1. They're off that top turn, racing past the stands. Dave Miller has brushed to the front with Banker's Note. Banker's Note grinds on top by two and a half. Racing second, Branson. Past the stand, Simcoe's image to third. Derculator is fourth. Moving up on the outside, C.J. Baker to fifth. Nowhere to go, Grand Sid to sixth. Racing seventh, no stone unturned as they move to the half mile pole. Here comes Benevolent Viking up on the outside, Wholesale Merchant and High Elvis. That's the 10 of them again by the halfway point in a minute and three fifths. They're down the back stretch. Grinding on top, Banker's Note. Banker's Note from Branson. Simcoe's image skims the rail third. C.J. Baker swings up on the outside. No stone unturned, closing between horses fifth. Benevolent Viking on the far outside sixth. Racing seven, Derculator. Nearest the rail, Grand Sid. Ranging up on the far outside comes High Elvis and the trailer's wholesale merchant. Racing by three quarters in 130 and two. A real log jam here as Dave Miller will bring him to the head of the stretch. Banker's Note tries to fend off the challenge. Here comes Branson driving out of the pocket like a rocket inside the final 16th. Rocking and rolling on top. It's Banker's Note. Branson alongside. Mad scramble for minor shares. The top two seem about home free. It's Banker's Note. Branson, C.J. Baker, and Dirk Leder. That's how they'll finish. Here comes the unofficial winner of tonight's 10th and final race, number 10, Banker's Note. Six-year-old Bay Gulling by Latatross out of Freedom Gal. Owned and trained in Kenton, Ohio by William Carruthers, given a well-judged drive tonight by David Miller. Covering that mile in two minutes and three-fifths. Number 10, Banker's Note, the winner. 10-7 exact at $28.60. We'll give you the pick three next. Three out of three, 151.40. The pick three, 151.40. Superfecta 797.80, 797.80.